Hi from Hampstead. Hi from Hampstead. Enjoy your day, girls. Thank you. Ladies and gents, welcome, welcome. It's a hot, hot day in London. 30 degrees these days. 14th of Ju June, sorry, not July. Look at all this selection here, how gorgeous. Let me take a picture of that. We are in Hampstead Heath. We are gonna check out the area a little bit more. It's still very hot. It's the afternoon now. But sun is definitely boiling. So as I came out of the station, I saw this amazing um, little garden. I didn't go in. We are going to go in together. I was just setting up my equipment, sitting on this st step here. And I just saw there is a secret garden here. So I thought, why don't I take you with me? You've got code of contact, uh, conduct here. And some wise words. World's Peace Garden, how nice. It's a small one apparently. You've got some decoration right there, let me zoom in. Well, not really decoration, it's that sound thingy. looking magical boys and girls very romantic we've got a little bench right here where you can chill another bench there's a secret tunnel through here Hopefully nobody uses it as a toilet. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised with London situation. There are no toilets whatsoever. So yeah, another decorations up here. Let's be zoom in. There and there. Oh wow, we've got more benches right here, they look really nice and a little waterfall that is not really flowing right now but it's looking nice. There are some obstacles for when there is water. There is bamboo happening here. It's so quiet. And another arch made from branches and I think soon it's gonna finish I'm not really sure let's see wow what an intense smell Hmm. 
is that jasmine guys i don't know my flowers <laughs> no what do we have here what's what's happening why is it becoming so blurry today i've never had that before oh there are some people actually What a nice surprise. So somebody put quite a lot of effort here, right? What a nice welcome to Hampstead. It's been a long time since, I, since I've been here. Last time on a live stream, actually, with you guys. Look at the fluffy puppy. And that was a long time ago. It feels like a year ago. Yeah, it, it actually could be a year, to be honest. There is a pub right here. It's fairly easy for me to get here, to be honest, um, from my home. And it's shocking that I haven't really been here a lot. It's a famous destination, you know, it's beautiful here. Very bad. <laughs> but don't worry, I'll be coming here now more often. trees are amazing much taller than me <laughs> so yesterday i went to southampton i can tick off another city in england that i've seen i'll be posting that video tomorrow i think it was nice it's always nice to get out and I don't have any plans where to go next, maybe winter, but these days it's so hot. Yesterday it was so incredibly hot filming, so I might actually wait a little bit until it becomes a little bit cooler, hopefully, because then it's nice to walk around. Yesterday was a struggle. And coming back, the aircon on... German people. The aircon on National Express bus was broken, so we had to wait one extra hour outside in Southampton and all in all he managed to come only half an hour later so not an hour later meaning back to London but we waited an hour to get on the bus it was completely full as you can imagine but at least we had aircon so but you know what guys some of these buses have um, you know the seat belt where you clip the seat belt it's kind of facing inwards into the seat and when we went to Edinburgh for nine hours I was sitting on a bus and I had literally blue bum for a week after that literally bruise proper bruise and yesterday as well luckily it was only two hours and a half but something is wrong with those and you can't move it it's like permanently fixed and yeah it's not good not all of the buses since i've been a few times now so the buses are completely different 
each and one of them are completely different. But I would like to go to Bright, uh, not Brighton. Brighton, I'm gonna go for Pride, Pride, Pride Parade, and obviously that's gonna trigger a lot of bad, bad messages. It is what it is. It's something happening in London. I document football. I have zero interest in football. I document a lot of other things I have zero interest in, or you know what I mean. And I'll be getting a lot of hate, as always, for some reason. It is what it is. Wow. People are definitely taking advantage of the sun. This is nice. We need to explore. Honestly, guys, I promise we are going to come Hampstead to, to Hampstead so many times, we are going to be sick of it. crazy that I go out of London and something that is so close to me you know I haven't really been to as much uh, with a camera before a long time ago yes look how gorgeous oh these people are lucky to live here this is so nice imagine you had a bad day at work and you can just come here and let the steam out of your ears. <laughs> let me check the time and let me check the degrees on my phone. One second. So it's 6.30, uh, sorry, 4.30. And it's 27 degrees. So full on, full on. And tomorrow the same and on Friday the same. And then we've got rain coming on a Sunday. Fingers crossed there will be some rain. <laughs> Wait. Oh, we've got some swannies down there. Oh, it's swans with babies. a woman with so many or is it a man with so many pigeons on him he's taking pictures let me see if I can come closer without him getting crazy <laughs> oh he's feeding them I think wow you've got the you've got a pigeon magnet do you come here every day I can't tell they love you, look at that. <laughs> and do you give them names? Um, uh, they, they do have names. <laughs> they don't give them names, but there's one bird, where is it? Um, there's what, what, um, <laughs> this is, this is, that one, that one here, I call it, call it that because it makes a sound sort of like a duck. But oh, okay. oh, okay, so you can recognize him like that? Look, they love you. <laughs> what do you say? Walk, walk. Walk, walk. Like W O C. Walk, walk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> How long have you been coming here so far? Um, I've lost count, but it's been maybe a couple of 
company is, I think, sort of obviously since the lockdown. So, so first, we're sort of, well, it was Hyde Park and then eventually during the lockdown we came here. So. Oh, this is amazing. I saw you from distance. I couldn't believe my eyes you were <laughs> swarmed. <laughs> Oh, and you give them expense. Oh, you stroke it. If you're interested, it's just um, it's just like um, sunflower, pumpkin seeds, and um, cashew. I saw the cashew. That's expensive. My goodness. Yeah, expensive. <laughs> Not everybody can afford that. <laughs> These pigeons are lucky. That's why they love you. <laughs> oh, I can see the cashew. Look, they can't get enough. Oh, it's not every day they find cashew nuts, that's for sure. No, it's difficult. Oh, he's on your, yeah. <laughs> he's on your head. And, um, the early one, the, um, what's the, uh, is it the heron over there, uh, but he kind of went away, so. Oh, he comes to you as well? Yeah, some, from time to time, of course, the swans, and then the, um, the ducks and the geese, who all kind of do these Oh, you've got a birdie and, magnet, yeah. big time then. <laughs> the, uh, my favorites, um, well, apart from the pigeons, um, it's like the mandarin ducks. Oh yeah. Uh, well, the male mandarin duck is very colourful. The female, she's a bit more. Sort of I'm gonna sit. I hope you don't mind. Oh. No, I don't mind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is amazing. Do they sometimes poo poo on your hair? Um, they might have done, but to be honest, I'm not uh, noticed that. But they're <laughs> on my trousers, and then of course they bite me a bit, but. <laughs> But I kind of got used to it. You know, <laughs> oh, this is amazing! They love um, you. The, the pooing and the bedding, it's what I would call an occupational Eden hazard. So, Say so, occup yeah. occupational what? Occupational Eden hazard. Eden? Yeah, like um, like the, Chel the ex Chelsea player Eden. I see, I see, I see, I yeah. see. <laughs> so I, kind of I can't believe you stroked him. Well, it's kind of like. I, um, think, I think you are the first person in the world that I see well, that actually strokes the pigeons. Well, I do, my That, best, is, so that um, is able might, to stroke them. You, you might have seen others, <coughs> perhaps. Uh, many people feed them. The, the guy on your on your head is so comfortable. Yeah. I think he's making a nest. I think he is. He's <laughs> just looking for. Unfortunately, there's no twigs or branches up there. Uh, but, you know, this yeah. is good. Uh, what's your name? Meow meow. Meow meow. Meow meow. Really? True true story. Sure. Um, I'm JP. Meow meow. <laughs> nice to meet you, JP. Yeah. And, um, you made my day. You see, I don't come. I don't come here quite often, but seeing this is already like highlight of my day. You know. Cool. Yeah, uh, are you a vlogger, as they might say? Yes, yes, just walk around London and see what's going on. And um, are you German? No, it's a it's a secret European destination that oh. nobody nobody knows about really. Oh, Switzerland, Austria. N nothing, nothing Italy. extra, nothing extraordinary. Belgium, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> who knows? Who knows? Anyway, anyway but it's, it's it's nice to see you, Mama. And, it's uh, nice to see you. I'm I'm heading towards. The, the swimming pools, oh, yeah, of course. Yeah, the ba bathing pools. Yeah, I see people in the water. This is yeah. insane. And, um, well, Wh which way shall I go? Just straight uh, there, yeah? This way. Just go down this path here, and then you see the path opposite oh, yeah. this one. Just go straight up there. Of course, um, straight up there. Perfect. After you've um, gone past, it, take an immediate left, mm -hmm. and then you've got like the men's mixed and bathing. Perfect. Pool. I already see some people here, so I'm gonna yeah. check them out. So nice meeting you. See you later. Yeah, I will. I will. I'm just gonna walk here and then come back through here and go there. See you later. Enjoy. You too. Meow meow. <laughs> oh my god. Well, I want to speak to these girls about the water. I've I haven't seen. Uh, I wish I caught them actually swimming. It's my first time here. Is it true? Is it true you can go in the water? <gasps> is it? Yeah, yeah, there's loads of people. So I think you have to pay to go that side. But you can let me. May I touch? Don't, may don't I touch your arm? May yeah. I touch your arm just to see how cold it is? It's fine. If the hell, you cold that fine. <laughs> Going in the middle of the day when the it's sun's nice, out, and it's, it's, it's genuinely quite nice. 
it's not bad. But we are still in June. <laughs> no, yeah, but it's what? 28 degrees today is fine. I know, but the water must be freezing. But are is you it... from a you originally from a much warmer country then? I, I usually go to Thailand for six. Yeah, right, okay. <laughs> okay, it's not quite Thailand. It's pretty cold then, but I, it's quite nice in the when, when it's hot in the sun, like you're, is she, you're is, she go, nice is she getting warm. ready to go in? Me? Oh no, we've yeah. just we've literally just got out. You just yeah. finished, yeah. But I honestly it's quite nice. It's refreshing. And, yeah, and is but, there um, any don't don't swallow in the water because it's grim. That's yeah. nice. No. You oh, so you just like dip, you, but you don't swim, so you don't swallow any stuff, yeah? No, but you can no. go to the paid ones. The paid ones are nicer. They're, yeah, the, there's there's paid ones. Over That's the where I'm that heading. Way, and there's some other ones which are, which are probably a bit nicer. I've heard I'm supposed to go there, yeah, and we just don't want to pay, so we've probably popped in here. But is, those ones over there are probably. Can I just ask a very important question? Yeah. What's on the ground, and how how? It's, it's quite slimy. it's quite muddy here, but then it gets it gets deep quite quickly, so you can't touch. I couldn't touch the bottom from like a few paces. I think up. it's not so bad over there, but over there, I think you. And do you have? Uh, yeah, I would prefer that. <laughs> that yeah, the, if all of the, all of the ground from any of the lakes is going to be like muddy. Or I, I would expect that. Yeah. Did you see any weird animals swimming around? No. Like Chernobyl, like five legs, no seven ducks. eyes. All we got is yeah, just some ducks. <laughs> so you're, you're fine. You're That's fine. fine. Thank you so much, girls. Enjoy. <laughs> This is turning into quite an eventful walk. What do you say, guys? We've got a pigeon man. We've got girls, brave girls, not shy, talk to the, on the camera. Very nice. And I touched her arm just to see the temperature. She was freezing, <laughs> absolutely freezing. Oh, this is nice. To be honest, I would prefer to go. Oh, I see some other people on the other end coming out through the mud. Oh dear. And oh, oh it smells quite bad. <laughs> um, how can I show you? There are some. The water has a lot of stuff. It's like a murky soup. I don't know if you can see it, but it's not a clear water. Uh, I, I think I would rather swim in, in the Thames. Please don't hate me, I'm just saying my opinion. It looks like it's, you know, a lot of stuff, stuff swimming there. I'm not, I'm not as brave. If I was too hot, I would probably, you know, I would probably do it. But yeah, it doesn't look inviting to me. So nice to be here. I feel like I'm out of London, guys. Look at the nature here. You can only imagine how busy it's gonna be during the weekend when everybody's off. Oh, so the white stuff is from, is from the tree. You see this fluff? Fluffy puppy, if you are watching, I think of you every time a fluff is being mentioned. Look so much fluff. You see that? I'm gonna play with it as I'm filming. I like fluffy. <laughs> oh, it feels good. So nice. Oh my gosh, what's happening today? Something is not okay. Sorry about the blurring of the camera. I need to reset something. But for now, we'll have to deal with it. I don't even know what to reset, to be honest, but such is life. Oh, just manual focus, automatic focus. Something is wrong with that. So, let me zoom in. Taking a few pictures for Instagram to entertain whoever is following me there. I feel responsible for your entertainment. We've got, you see.
Oh my god. You see, and that's on top of on top of the fact that I said it's not looking good for swimming. How, how was the water, guys? Was it too cold or not? It wasn't too cold. It was, it was cold, it was but not bad. Refreshing. It so, so it's my first time here. Us too. Is this really? Is this? How much does it cost? Did you pay? We did. I think to pay to go during the peak times you have to pay, and it was like five pounds. But so I it's not crazy. It's, it's right not like twenty or something. No, no. no but I think right now, like in the evenings and mornings, it's free. It oh. might be free. And was the water clearer? Sorry, I'm playing with the fluff. Was, was the water clearer than here? It, there is actually a warning there. Did you see? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. that's very no, this is yeah? like made to be swimming. And just last question: When you touch the floor, if you do, is it kind of muddy? We never I like that. I like that. I might come in my bikini yeah. tomorrow or something it's like that. Really nice. Thank you so much, guys. See you later. Strong. Oh, my fluff has gone. That was nice though. Now, fluffy puppy, if you are watching, there is a real fluff coming, you see. Right here, fluffy. Right here. So it's five pounds, which is not a lot, you know, if the water is decent. Better than your garden. You know, and if you can't touch the, the ground, yeah, it would be probably absolute. Why not? I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be told off if I try to go there with my camera, but I'll try to see what I can. <laughs> I try to show you the access area. Let's see. I see some water lilies in there. Let me try to reset that annoying thing, the autofocus. One minute. Oh, what is it? Is it feel like Yeah, I, I can't find any anywhere how to fix it right now. Let's see. Is that a queue to get in? So, from what I've seen, I think they close at eight. Oh my gosh, what is this? A queue? I wonder if they are leaving or trying to get in. Can I just ask, what is this queue for? It's for the swimming for the pond. Oh my goodness, and they close at 8 o'clock or something like that? 8 8.30. Good to know, my first time here, thank you. <laughs> wow, that's a long queue for middle of the week. <gasps> oh my goodness. Somehow I didn't realize there would be queue. He's got his card reader there. It was kind of like, uh, oh, I hope you don't need the toilet. Yeah, it's good because then you don't have to. Okay, do you need to make sure? I think it's good. Yeah. See, we need to put in advance. Wow. Like, I booked for us, like, when? Yeah. Yeah. I really want to go and see what it looks like. What's the process like? Um, I don't think I will be able to. Well, there is only one way to find out. Come later and try it myself. Yeah, I mean, I, 
How does it work, guys? Do you have to book in advance? Uh, I mean, we booked in advance. Uh, uh, maybe you can book. buy the tickets. Yeah. It's, it's a busy pool, but isn't it? Yeah. them before because it was so loud. So, so, so this is a mix. This is yeah. the mix. And there is another man, female, and another just male. How do I get to the female? I just want to see how big it is, how clean it is. Mm. In the... On, the, on the map. On the map. Yeah, 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 I'll do that. Thank you so much. Oh, you know what? You need a bit. Come here. So, actually, dry. Oh, actually, dry. Just open my mouth. Open the lips. Open the lips. No, it's actually for anywhere. So, where are you going now? We're going to chill for a bit. I love it too. And my friend loves it. For me, better actually. I mean, Oh, so it's just these those three poles here. Okay, okay, okay. So I can be returning through here. Um, now, where shall we? Where shall we go now? <laughs> there was this Hampstead Heath. Hold on. Shall we go Parliament Hill viewpoint? Six minutes. Oh yeah, baby. Oh, is it this way? No. Oh, my map is going bananas. It says this way, I think. <laughs> Guys, would you know which way is the Parliament Hill, please? Um, Parliament Hill. I don't know. No ways. Nobody knows. Well, it looks like I should be going this way. It better be correct, since I'm going uphill. <laughs> I mean, it, it is a hill, so <laughs> it's a good start. <laughs> oh my goodness, it's busy. It's Wednesday afternoon now, guys. <laughs> guys, can I double check with you? Parliament Hill, am I going the right way? Uh, no. <laughs> no worries. <laughs> because I see kind of just bushes around here. He seems to know. <laughs> Guys, would you know Parliament Hill? No, I got <laughs> No worries. That's way, yeah? Hallelujah. <laughs> Thank you. It's always good to double check when you go up the hill. You don't want to be walking in vain. <laughs> Look at that. This place is amazing. Look at this tree. Look at these trees. Wow. Oh shit, I'm gonna get lost in the bushes and Blair Beach will find me. Yeah, I should probably check them up. 
the uh, Parliament Hill. Uh, right up there. Can, can I, that way, yeah? Thank you. Oh, sugar. My map is showing me in the middle of nowhere, which seems to be correct since there is no proper path. But yeah, she's correct. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Down. Should be going to the left here. Oh yeah, we've got a hill. I've got I see loads of people there. So that's good. I can relax. I don't have to check directions anymore. But going through that nature there, getting lost in Hampstead Heath was very nice. Those trees were incredible. What a beautiful place. Somehow, guys, I expected there would be nobody here because it's, it's Wednesday, you know? But, oh my goodness, the queue was very long. So Saturday, Sunday is going to be absolutely mad. It's going to be, you know, three times as, as long, I assume. And I think one of the guys said it was sold out already today. Oh my gosh. It's a woman looking for her doggy. I'm showing you the green grass, some nature. There's a fluffy puppy by the bench with a tongue out. Same, same me. <laughs> Going up the hill.
There's a picnic. How are I? Oh, sorry. Oh, I see more water down there. I think those are the other lakes. Oh, I'm definitely gonna go there. The summer is here. They are shooting something. Good grief. Something. Another fluffy puppy with a tongue out. The tank is longer than the puppy itself. Yes, yes. I hope they got water for him. Wow, it's still hot, guys. I'm just, I'm not complaining. I'm just giving you feedback. In case, you know. <laughs> You were planning to come here at this time. My face is getting proper blasted with the sun. So let me face this way for a minute. Let me look at the map. Maybe one day I become fluent. It's... I used to come here. I used to come here quite a lot in the past. I used to know it quite well, uh, but uh, that was a long time ago. So, so yeah, what is it called again? Highgate Men's Bathing Pond. Sounds good to me. <laughs> Russian, seriously, the Russian defense office is there as well. There is something called the fairy tale. What is it? Uh, looks like a just pond, whatever. Yeah, let's check it out. A few, few more ponds going on there. So it's going to be a complete walk around Hampstead ponds, ponds, well actually not really because I saw more ponds all over the place so not, not the ultimate one. We are gonna go wee down the hill. Well Norma, if you are watching Norma, see this is a perfect spot to take your cardboard, cardboard from your washing machine or whatever and slide down. This is the perfect time and perfect hill. You see that Norma? Oh, this would be marvelous. <laughs> Looks like somebody has done it here as well. <laughs> it's kind of on the side as well. But no, these days kids have um, video games. They don't do stuff like that. Plus, it will probably completely destroy the grass as well. <laughs> so probably not ideal. But I like the thoughts of you, Norma. I don't know what you look like, but I, I got the image of you <laughs> loving it down the hill on a cardboard. Let me actually take a picture of this Hampstead scenery. Why not? While it's nice and green, you know, we had proper storm two days ago. I was out filming like stupid. Oh my God. I'm not gonna do that anytime soon. It's just not worth it. Almost destroyed my equipment. Uh, my shoes are destroyed and stinky. Some some ponds there. I don't know if it's it's like wetlands. I don't know if it's the duck poo and swan poo accumulated, but it just smells so like like raw sewage, really intense, especially like during the rain, you know. And even the bushes, everything stank like a dead dog. Uh, it's just so weird. I don't know why it was so so smelly. So my sh and and the edge of the lake, like the water was completely black, like literally like sewage. So weird. Like you know, when I go to Pakistan and India, they have those black canals 
alongside the road that smell and they got it covered here and there with pieces of concrete literally that's what we are talking about in a pond where ducks and swans are swimming so i don't know but it's good to be here i was kind of 50 50 if i should go out today or not oh my god i would have missed out on proper adventure today if i didn't come here i'm loving it i was sun tanning in my garden this morning because i'm still white as a ghost and i need some vitamin d after the long winter and you know i've been coughing i was coughing for like six six months i don't understand it um it's so it's so good to, not to cough i can speak like a normal human it's amazing so let's see what the winter brings but i don't know if i can go through coughing like that again it almost gave me six pack oh guys look at this you don't wanna oh <laughs> that hurts <laughs> it's pretty sharp you see how tall it is what's the name of this um in english i wonder if this is the I know there is something cancer healing related. Burdock, burdock, burdock. I don't really know. Burdock. <laughs> I cannot know how you spell it. And I think they make tea out of it. I'm not really sure what they do. I forgot too much info with this kind of stuff, but I'll have to Google it if this is what it is. I'm probably wrong. But there's so much of it here and this is clean you know in the middle of nowhere no cars no nothing so that's interesting to see I'm so stupid I came here with long sleeves again uh, yeah that, uh, that, that was a big mistake I do have a like a vest sleeveless vest so I'm gonna probably take a little break here in the shade well after I first I show you what it looks like this looks amazing and we are gonna walk around but I'm gonna take my thin thingy off this is what I have on let me show you in the Sun Decathlon 25 pounds. I bet they make it for like a pound. You see this kind of stretchy material? Expensive and it's so easy to tear. But I like it. <laughs> and I wear it a lot, all, all of these colors, all of these things. Oh my god, I love it. There's like a walk. Okay, let's walk to the other side. Can you, can you actually swim in here? Yeah, that part in the middle is Oh yeah, I'm blind, sorry, thank you. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wow, so it's not only those ponds. There was such a long queue for the mixed ponds because I think it's like a Tinder in real life. Um, you know, once you see somebody in bikini or shorts, less then <laughs> it's easy to take it from there oh I can show you this yeah. okay. right but basically what I'm trying to say you can't see the bottom of it it's, it's a pond you know what a pond looks like I obviously don't <laughs> I seem to be surprised <laughs> oh my god loving the grass how many snakes live in there I like this walk 
by the grass. It's really nice. And there is another pond right there. I'm loving it here. Oh, it's literally a sin to go to other cities before exploring this kind of um, areas here. And I'm pretty sure, where did I see? There is a beach in Rus Ruslip. Ruslip? I don't know what you call it. So it's within London. It's quite far away though. Very far away. But the beach there looks pretty decent. Very good. But it's so far away. But you know what? If I go to other places and travel two, two hours and a half, I might actually do, go and explore. Hello! Uh, you have to jump over. There's no gate down there. No gate down there. Oh, really? Yes. You can climb over there. Thank you. Oh, really? Yes. Thank you so much, Omka. So, I spoke to some lovely fishermen while I was taking my uh, t-shirt off, whatever, and they told me they sometimes fish like 20, like 48 hours in one go or something like that, and couples come here for jiggy jiggy, apparently, like they've seen all sorts, all so oh sugar, there is somebody literally, oh my god, I swear, that must be... <laughs> They, they either have like nude, oh my god, that's a G-string, a blue G-string. <laughs> okay, at least he's got a, a dental floss. <laughs> so yeah, that's what they told me. They, they showed me a, a picture of a massive, massive fish that they caught. Uh, that touches legs of the ladies in other ponds, apparently. And he said he would be scared. And he's a fisherman and he said he would be scared to catch something like that. Uh, sorry, not catch. If something that touched him in, uh, in the pond. <laughs> this is boys only. I would love to go closer, but you know, privacy. Uh, I bet they will be friendly as well. They are getting ready for the parade, for sure. What else did they tell me? Oh, they told me there is 14 lakes here in Hampstead Heath. Um, we are walking towards the ladies pond, which is like three ponds up. And it's like 15 minute walk from here. So... I'm learning. I asked those guys if they would like to say something on the camera. And they said, no, 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 we've had some beers. No, we don't want to. So that would be nice. They were really friendly, really nice. See, this looks like the edge of a lake right here, doesn't it? Oh, the sun in my face. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is fabulous. Oh, this is amazing. Oh, my God. How come I... Somehow in the past I didn't... I don't think I came to this area. I was somewhere completely else. I was in Hampstead Heath, but not, not around here. Or if I came here, I, I just took it for granted by the look of it. Because usually it would be during the winter when I came here. But in the summer, it looks gorgeous. <laughs> Can you imagine the weekend here must be completely full when this is 5 p.m. Wednesday? Oh, 
Yeah, I'll go for oh, no, bro. No, no, no. Fuck you, stop being in. Is it cold? It's okay? Yeah, yeah. Not too cold? <laughs> I see a little fish right there. Oh, look at that. No swimming underwater hazard. hazards. Oh, yeah, you've got the other pools, don't you? And look, these guys. These guys don't mess around. <laughs> So I, I guess I just follow this place and follow this path and end up by a different lake, pond. Oh my gosh, I'm loving it today, guys. Oopsie daisy. Maybe it's from the grass, you know, like some particles, who knows? Oh yeah, no, it says the blue-green something. This is beautiful, I love it. What was I doing last summer? How come I didn't come here? I can't even remember, I was in Barcelona. I can't remember. I think I was just here filming somewhere else. Oh, yeah, there is another. There is another pond here. And thank God I didn't come here during the lunchtime as I originally wanted. Somehow I thought coming here this time is gonna be like too late, you know, I will be here alone. And yeah, I thought it's not gonna be nice. I was wrong. This is the perfect time to come. It's still very hot. <laughs> I'll shut up about it. Just giving you feedback. God, this is magical, honestly, who lives here? They're so lucky. Now I would understand why the properties around here are so expensive because this is luxurious, you know?
much is falling down. Okay, I better check the map. There is this Kenwood house, right? That's what I registered. I'm not really sure where it is. I've got only one hand to play with the map. You know, you need kind of two fingers to zoom in, zoom out. I'm holding the phone, so it's a little bit tricky. Let me see, there is like another small path here. Yeah, it should be on the small path. Right here. So it seems the mixed pool, the mixed pond is the busiest for obvious reasons. put it on my to-do list or what you call it bucket list um, to come and swim here one day if others can do it Mia Mio can do it and in Brighton as well since I've never been I always go only film you know I never really participate in the fun so I should change that I can hear the ladies already laughing. Let's have a look through there. There's somebody tanning right there. Oh my god, it's busy. Somehow I expected the ladies would be lonely. What I'm really interested in to see how clean the water is, if it has those, if it's kind of murky, I assume it will be, right? I mean, it's ponds. I'm just being spoiled, <laughs> but I'm, I'm trying to, you know, uh, convince myself to come here and actually swim. Or if there is a, like a outdoor swimming pool, I would definitely be up for that. I think in Leighton there was one, or was it Tooting, Tooting? Yeah, hold on, this was Tooting Beck. I'm pretty sure, oh my God, a rabbit. Guys, I see a rabbit.
Can you see the bunny? Do you call that hair? Just because I found him in the nature, the rabbit becomes a hare. Hoppity hop. This is Hampstead for you. Oh, this is amazing. What a, what a gorgeous walk, guys. Please press the like button. I never really encourage you in the video, but this walk is turning amazing. <laughs> I don't think this is the right way to come here. I think I should have come from the other side, obviously, but at least now you know not to make the same mistake like me and figure out a way how to come from the other side. There's another lake here. If you hear something, I've got water in my backpack and it's kind of making sounds for some reason. That's what it is. I, I wish it wasn't. <laughs> Look at these grass, how amazing. it's gorgeous here. You see that reflection of the trees, how gorgeous. Oh my gosh, I feel like I'm in some kind of national park. Seriously. Where were we? We are gonna check out as much as we can uh, the ladies' pool. I assume there is gonna be potential trouble me trying to film anything around there uh, because it's ladies only. But well, let's see. Fluff. We always get in a trouble together, don't we? <laughs> How was it, guys? Was the water cold? Yeah, very. Good. Yeah, Fi finally, good temperature, good temperature. finally, I found some humans who tell the truth. <laughs> Twenty degrees. <laughs> Still cold. <laughs> Look at this. Wow, that's massive. Can you imagine if this fell next to you? My God. That's almost as tall as me. I mean, it is taller than me. Yeah, it is definitely taller than me. That's crazy. Yeah, but I must say I'm not I'm not as stupid as I was last year this year. I've learned from my mistakes. I used to come out at lunchtime. Like yesterday in Southampton I've been filming, you know, in lunchtime and on the sun. So that was not great. But I actually like coming out like three, four, five. Better four, five, six. <laughs> uh, when it's not as crazy. There is some shade going on. I was too, I was too eager to film last year, and 
you know, when I when I put on my video, I'm filming in a 30 degrees, you know, heat wave. I felt like I must struggle, <laughs> and I was out there. This year, I'm smarter. Most of the time. This is a nice walk. Look at this. This would be like a nice background for a, for some photography with that green color. Very nice. This is a gorgeous time of the year to be here. Looks very nice with the green, green leaves everywhere. Thank God for the shade. Don't come from the other side, that's, that's brutal. It's very hot. <laughs> right there, here it's much better. So there is a long queue and somehow I don't think I'll be able to go and see the pond if it's clean or not. So I'm returning from the area where the ladies are sun tanning and swimming. I managed to get in just to see what it looks like. Sorry. Because I spoke to a lady who comes here, who's been coming here for 40 years uh, to swim. She encouraged me to go there and have a look. You can't really see much, there's a lot of bushes. Uh, I can confirm <laughs> ladies are sun tanning <laughs> like Adam and Eve. No, no fig leaves going on. Um, the pond is big, very big. Uh, I saw a bunch of, um, I don't know what you call it, what you throw when somebody is um, drowning, those wheels on the bus. I don't know what it's called, sorry. Um, and you get down uh, on a ladder. And that's pretty much all. Looks amazing. But me personally, I would, I would probably still prefer <laughs> swimming pool. <laughs> you know, if I had the same distance to a swimming pool and to this place, I would choose a swimming pool because that's just me. Oh, I should. Oh, I should. I should look where I'm going. Guys, do, do you know where Hampstead Station is on Northern Line? This direction. We're going to the overground. I'm not sure. It's where. okay, no worries. I'll just. <laughs> I'll figure it out. Thank you. Uh, let me see. There is an ice cream truck. No, Mia Mia, you fat. Stop it. <laughs> this is 
actually nice. I'm gonna go this way. I never thought Wednesdays could be this fabulous. I think this is the road I should be taking right here. But it's busy here and I want to walk by the water. So I'm gonna do that. I want to see if many people came in the meantime while I was walking in the bushes. Oh. Oh my gosh, there's somebody swimming with the duckies. I prefer to walk this way in case they thought it was funny to push me in the lake. <laughs> you never know, I got you know equi equipment with me. I can't risk it. You have to be prepared for everything, so better to be safe than sorry. Oh my god, the way I'm supposed to walk, it's kind of sunny. <sighs> like towards the sun. Whew. I don't really want to do that, to be honest. It's very hot. I know I said it 10 times, I'll shut up. I'm just thinking out loud. How to get out of here. Let me just snap a quick picture to demonstrate how busy it was today. Oh, I can't imagine weekend. And the good thing about this location, it's kind of safe when it comes to equipment. You know, you don't have your usual phone snatchers around here. You know, this is bushes here. Um, so I'm going to take an easy way out and stay in the shade and wherever we end up, I'm going to take buses or whatever. Yeah, but I don't want to go in the sunny area. Oh, we came through here, I see. Short memory, meow meow, short memory. This is where the boys are.
So let me get this name here. Highgate. Looks like it's around 450. Then something else was seven pounds something. So I didn't manage to read what, what was it for, what it was for. Now it's six o'clock. Six p.m. and I'm trying to avoid the sun like, <laughs> like the plague. Oh my goodness! Where are we? Just looking at the map quickly. Um, yeah. Oh, there are my fishermen. <laughs> there are my fishermen right there. I'm gonna give them privacy. Those were the ones who said they didn't want to be filmed for an interview because they had some beers. Catching some big fishes, some big fish. You too guys, good to see you. I hope you catch I hope you catch the biggest fish ever today. You got my you got my blessing. Thank you. See you later. I will. It's the boys that has to watch out around near Meow Meow. Not the Meow Meow around the boys. <laughs> He said, stay safe. That's what I'm referring to in case you didn't hear what I'm talking about. So yeah, beautiful, beautiful. There is a face on this tree. Uh, look at this massive. That looks proper ancient. That bark looks incredibly wrinkly. I don't know if you can see it. I'll probably zoom in for you. You see that? Looks like Jurassic Park. Oh my gosh, if this fall on, fell on my head, there would be no more Miao Miao, only pancake. Now, ladies and gents, whoever lived in Hampstead or is going to live in Hampstead or has something to say about Hampstead, please do so in the comment section. I'm always happy to hear from the local people. And this is such a massive area. There must be quite a few people who love this area. Look how gorgeous at this time of the day, gorgeous. So leave me some comments, entertain me in the comment section. I love reading your feedback. Thank you so much. I 
know I'm supposed to go up the hill. I just refuse. <laughs> As I said, I refuse. direction I remember I used to come here a long time ago as I said but coming through here uh, that was such a long time ago oh you can smell this tree I don't know the name in English but you know some people make cold drink or even tea with it you see this one it smells so intensely Intensive, intensively or intensely? Oh, geez, my English. Oh, <laughs> that's a good boy, a good girl in the pony. Living the best life. He's gonna sleep like a baby after swimmies, after swimming. so lovely here guys I really hope I will encourage some of you to come here don't be like me last year I didn't come here at all what a mistake guys I wouldn't mind coming here every day <laughs> it's so beautiful I see buses that means civilization is near. Let me see the map quickly. Oh, I could go to gospel oak if I continue going kind of straight which is good enough for me I will have to come to Hampstead when it's not so hot guys I'm so sorry I would love to explore I would love to go now to uh, Hampstead sta um, station and walk around there <laughs> it's just uh, and I said, too uh, much and he said you know can you put something together for me reason why I'm mentioning it is because yesterday I had full blast on my face in Southampton so today there is only so much I can take take you know what I mean and I was actually tanning myself in the garden uh, I tried not the face but I just had too much Sun these days so that's why I need a little break from the Sun Southampton Marina, the reflection was a bit much. Tomorrow. tomorrow is Thursday. Where shall I go film tomorrow? Oh, I 
wouldn't mind doing a night walk to be honest. It's been a long time since I've done one. I would love that. It's six o'clock. It gets dark. What like nine? It's like in three hours. I haven't eaten anything um, in a long time. Looks like we've got toilets here. So that is amazing. Stay where you are. I'm just gonna check if I'm a girl or a boy. I'll be right back with you, okay? Stay where you Ladies are. Ladies and gents, I'm gonna end the video here. I'm making my way towards Gospel Oak. Thank you so much for watching. Please press the like button. Please subscribe. I think this was an absolutely gorgeous video. Beautiful nature in London. Uh, leave me some comments underneath the video, please. If you have anything to say about Hampstead or anything to say at all, <laughs> I love reading your comments. Thank you so much. I see you next time. Take care.